After two years of battling the pandemic and other calamities, it is time for Malaysia to recover and focus on rebuilding the economy. However, Centre for Market Education Dr. Carmelo Ferlito cautioned us of underlying economic threats that may slow down our recovery for this year, starting with rising inflation. One of the uh, most uh, important issues for the next year will be inflation. And um, government spending, government money creation or borrowing goes together with inflation. So we cannot mitigate inflation and thinking to keep on spending money or creating money from Bank Negara, easy credit, uh, um, uh, easy borrowing, as it has been done in the past two years. So if we want to mitigate the impact of inflation, we must imagine um, a program of gradual uh, spending cuts from the government side. Um, and this is very delicate because we are still in a very uncertain moment. Um, we have to face new emergencies like the like the flood that recently happened um, and how the government is going to handle the abundance of money supply will be very crucial to uh, to understand the direction that inflation is going to take. Carmelo outlines short-term measures to tackle inflation but emphasized the importance of spending cuts by the government. Act in the direction of removing all uh, that obstacles that make difficult for the supply chain to be restored. So we need uh, uh, more freedom of trade. So those items that are not produced um, uh, in a, enough quantity in our country needs to be imported and need to be imported at favorable conditions. Uh, we need also to allow uh, foreign laborers, foreign hiring to be uh, reopened again to ease uh, the burden on labor costs. So these are all things that need that can be done in the short run. Uh, but again, as uh, the core of inflation is uh, a monetary, uh, at the core, inflation is a monetary phenomenon, we need to act uh, imagining less uh, government spending for the year to come if we really want uh, to tackle uh, inflation.